Well, hello, Mr. Voyager here with How to Hold a Trumpet. You hold your trumpet in your left hand. So, everybody get your left hand. Woo! And then, what you're going to do is behind the first valve, that's where your thumb goes. And then the rest of your fingers go and hold the valves after. Now this ring can actually move and adjust to be closer or farther away. I like it farther away so that way I have room for my fingers inside. So I put my thumb on one side of the valves, left thumb. The other fingers go to the other side, my ring finger, and then my pinky kind of just hangs out because my hand is so big. So this way you are holding your trumpet with just your left hand. Your right hand is going to get on top and do the valves. We'll get to that in a second. This should be comfortable. We do not really want to have any sea monsters coming out and hanging out up here. We don't need to hold it like a bugle. And uh, I think that's going to be it. Now your right hand is going to go to the other side. You're going to make a C like the letter C. Your thumb is going to just chill inside the first and second valve spot right in there. It's not going to be jamming. It's just chilling, hanging out. Then fingers on top. One, two, three. Your pinky has the option. If you have a pinky ring, you can go in or on it. I don't, so my pinky is just going to be hanging out. And then when you push down your valves, if you push them straight down, they should come straight up. Straight down, straight up, straight down, straight up. That way, you're going to get them. If your hand flattens out, they're going to get stuck. So, you keep that good C, that good bear claw going right on top. And this, my friends, is how you hold the trumpet. <laughs>